All right. So we got Samu on his Rosaluma versus Big Money Zyke. Also known as the Fair Machine versus the Nair Machine. Uh, not a matchup I'm familiar with. I just feel like Luma has a really short shelf life in this match. I love being proved right immediately. Trying to land, get some options going out. Not pressuring off the stage at all. Walks up and grabs the, gets the grab though. Luma immediately dying. There we go. Gets him off stage. Now we gotta see. I don't know how well this can be edge guarded. Yeah, big money immediately going after that Luma. Dash attack missing. Just getting him in the air though, getting those up air strings, trying to edge guard him with the jab. Yeah. 122 though, so this stock should end soon. If not, letting Ike roll around with a rage seems like a scary idea. But again, yeah. Luma's just a non factor in this, it would seem. I don't know what. Wooper and Sobek are doing. Man, Oof, two frames in with the eruption. Samu has, uh, has a little bit of work to do here if he wants to uh, not go down a game in the first round. Oh my god. You hate to see that thing happen. What? I don't know, in a bit. Alright, so Samu opting to go for a tri-flat. Hopefully, maybe get some respite from the uh, Ike aerials is, I guess, his hope. Hi. Oy, oy, oy. Missing half your character for the majority of this game seems real rough. And yeah, Ford Tilt just takes it off the side. I'm trying to get it. Nah. Not able to challenge that. The disjoint of Luma, or, uh, Rosa Luma not being able to quite match the disjoint of actually having a big old sword. Get back up. See if we can take close the stock out before it's kind of a bit of a chore to close the gap. Got to be careful. He got hit by it again. So he just looks away and thinks, Oof, "What am I doing?" Throws him off stage. He's able to close up the stock during the recovery. That's probably his best option. If he goes too high, you should be able to hit him with Luma instead of getting dragged down like he has these last couple stocks. But at this point, he needs to figure out a way back onto stage. Apparently, fair is the way to do it. He's able to get him. Just keeps on getting hit by short hop in fairs, though, as he gets up. I'm not sure if he's just letting him go shield too early or just holding forward too much. 
able to keep himself in with a DI, but this is... No, gets right up, doesn't hold shield, gets hit by four tilts. Knocks him right out of the screen. Because of the lack of walk away, I'm going to assume these are best of fives. Not yet, but... Alright. We got Samu going into the think tank. Sweet baby Samu going into the think tank. Like, man, if I can only just not get hit by sword, I'll keep my stocks. Really just getting punished hard on his get-ups. Just gotta somehow change that up. Or I can see this game going the way it did the other two. There we go, here we go. Oh, immediately. Big Money just goes after that star. Understands it's uh, not quite a full character without it. Ooh, misses. Has a, ooh, percently gets equalized up real fast. Gets the grab, throws him off. Just, as long as he doesn't try and go off stage too much against them. He's got to start punishing those landings. Ooh, parry on the forward air. Again, immediately Luma's dead. Still Sam doing a bit better, playing a bit more patient. Just gets him off stage. This time punishes the landing of the quick draw in. Grabs him, throws him off. Here we go, keeps, keeps him off stage. Hits him with the up smash. This is what we want to see. Again, though, like a single forward tilt, and Luma's just no longer a part of the game. Uh, just seems like quite the quite the deficit to overcome. Now, forward tilt, Luma out. Forward tilt, Rose out. Comes in. Thomas jumps. Oh, that's nice. Forward throw into his Luma. Gotta be careful going off stage again. Game against two oh for the from from for money. Want some want some headset? Here you go. Yeah. Uh, we just lied about it, Smug Man. That's gonna be a really funny prank at the oh, end. Hi, Smug Man. Just gonna buy a bunch of uh, Twixes from the vending machine. <laughs> And, oh, did he get him back? Yeah, well, no. I think he's keeping Luma in. That's what I'm really paying attention to. Yep, Luma comes back. Wow, wow. that was quite the trek. He's just narrowing on a shield. And narrowing on a shield, and, and like, Luma's just not a part of this game. Ike handles her so well. Yeah, that Nair. Yeah, he's doing a better job of, like, punishing his get-ups, and, like, he lost a lot of stocks to trying to down-air Ike off stage and getting caught by the uh, up -y and then like, losing a stock to the uh, drag down of it. That doesn't surprise me. But, uh, I mean... He's learned now, so... He dies so early to up air, too. He dies early to a lot of things. Rosa is a light character. I feel yeah, like he would I, die yeah, if he got hit here. He needs to be careful, though. He's not really punishing any of the big money get-ups. Yeah. He's able to catch him with another up smash. Yo, was this winner's finals? Uh, this is winner's no, this is, this is winner's semis. semis. Yeah, no, okay. Okay. Nathan's oh, as I just get that. But again, just at this point, he's just getting damage on him, which is nice. Keep yeah. him off stage. Oh, this is, yeah, he's playing for damage, which is really yeah, great. Yeah, he's got to be careful about these things, though. He needs to like, be setting up uh, ledge traps wow, he against the Ike. He hasn't been able to challenge him offstage at all. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, Ike is kind of hard to challenge offstage. Yeah. Like, if you don't have well, a Well, I don't think Rose has the tools to. Yeah. Either. Like, generally, the big disjointed forward air will be he's what definitely you need. But, doing I mean, Rosa things with that. Yeah. Also, like, her disjoints don't match Ike disjoints. No way, yeah. So... He needs to like punish the big leggy moves, which but he was um, doing earlier. Um, Thomas doesn't seem to be edge guarding either, though, which is yeah. nice. Well, there you go, though, right? Like, just like a, like a forward tilt completely removes Luma from the game. Yeah. And a forward tilt of this part will kill Samu as well. Yo, 100%. Or he'll yeah, die. Just catch there. him with the up air. But he's at 86, so this is like a, a good grab and maybe an up smash away from the game being over. Oh, a couple nares, yeah, a couple yeah, backers. Catch that rolling. 
good also. Be able to get him in the air. I guess like heavy though. I I doesn't have great landing options though, does no. he? No. It's like well, much like Roy. Nair. But like being juggled and stuff is a landing option. True. Oh my lord. That was really unsafe. So he just gets the ledge for yeah, free there. He just needs to like, catch this. Yeah. So he's been doing is. He's getting the outsmashes yeah. now. Yeah, outsmash. Like, if he had Luma there, he yeah. was dead. Yeah, hundred percent. Catch him with a dash attack. Oh, yeah. oh, an up air there might have killed. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I think that was probably the input he wanted. Yeah, that ha I've done that so many times. Yeah. Ooh, gets In that a good spot right, right here. I think this could be it. If he picks it's hard to up. tell. He, yeah. Oh, gets him. All right, here we so, go. So, so we're not gonna we're not gonna walk away as a 3-0. To quote Jackson, quoting me, keeping it competitive. <laughs> So we're gonna see. This is the first time uh, I think uh, Big Money has been able to pick the stage. We've yeah. been basically been the triplat for a while. Uh, I think this might have been the first stage they're on. I can't remember. Wait, where did they go? Because <laughs> like you can't go to a stage. Either. Oh yeah, you can't pick okay. battle. If you won battlefield, I can't remember what the first map was. Alright. Surprisingly, no Kalos pick. I know that Nathan, or not Nathan, um, Thomas really likes Kalos. He uh, kind of washes people on it. And, you know, taking a lot of damage. Ah, uh, here we go. Luma's gone now. Yep, and now you can just kind of go to town. If he gets hit or he misses anything, he just gets snared a bunch. He might die here. Just a bunch of hitboxes being thrown out. That's all he really needs to do with Nathan. He's getting whiff punished a lot. Going after, I was able to catch him after missing that back air on the Luma. And he goes for down. But again, he's off stage now. He has to worry about it. Like, just gonna wait for him to get up and try to react to it. Oh, really yeah, good catch out of shield. I'm trying to like avoid talking about the people, the, the, the players' habits. Yeah, well, you can tell him, right? Like, yeah, really. As you watch it again, but like, whew, it's like yeah, you forgot what happened the first two games going up and doing that. It's a good thing you didn't get punished and lose a stock from it. Yeah, um, you know, and then he loses a stock from it. Well, he loses a stock from just a, you know, no. near up. Classic near. Yeah, near up, up air. The, the guy classic. He's trying to get out of the corner. He successfully does. Nathan doesn't yeah. react to it in time. He gets grabbed. That's near. Ooh. Gets yeah, Luma able to, a lot of times, was able to break combos like that. Yeah, which, which is, nice. is really nice for yeah. Nathan. Gets up jumps. Just kind of running away with it right now. Not attacking, so he's getting followed up by the dash attack. Nathan definitely needs to close out the stock, or he's gonna be in serious trouble. Uh, I, I with a stock lead is quite scary. Having to approach a character with the big sword is kind of awful. But Ganon's so scary. It's hard. Like, the fact that like Luma's just not no, a part no of this. throw. Is he just no match. <laughs> no. Thomas just looks, yeah, just looks over at stage him. Stage control. And then he almost dies for it because he didn't throw. But the up smash de deceptively large from Luma. Yeah, that's what he's gonna try, probably try and close this out with. He's, gonna, he's gone from just he's straight. Gonna get, he's gonna try and yeah. Cool, he's gonna try and get his up with it. He dies in this. My Nathan's God. gonna have to. He's gonna have to pull out the. And people say Falco up air back or up tilt back airs. No. Uh, no, bad. no one says that. That's a totally reasonable kill combo. And <laughs> <laughs> this is Ike Nair into up air is the probably the most annoying combo it's in like the game. Like eighty? Like what is it? What is like it? Ninety. Confirm at. Like, Wait, it depends like on a, character. Like, like Bowser, it's like one twenty. Okay, it's like a hundred and six when like Rose is dead off of it. Yeah, but like honestly, Ike is such a stupid character. Yeah, eh, whatever. I mean. You can go Great red ledge get up read. Yeah, there we go. Like that's what he needs to do, right? He's There's kind of play. Like up air is like just incredible. They need to should never have changed it. Eh. Begin the gift or something, Harry. Probably. He needs to get him off stage, and he needs to. He needs a stock, or he needs to play really well for the next two songs. Yeah, it's gonna be and not lose neutral like six times. This will be hard. There goes Luma. Yeah. He's gonna have to. Right. But he is in control, so he can kind of camp until Luma. <laughs> just running at him. That's the classic run and get shield grabbed. That would have killed if it was an up air. And then he dies. Just misses, doesn't snap ledge, and goes. Good playing. I like he's a salt cam ready. Did you